The Speed Stacks Gen 4 timer is the official timer of the WCA, and it's awesome. Therefore, I went ahead and got one. Hey everyone, Andrew here. Let's unbox this package. This is from speedstacks.com, and it is the Gen 4 timer and mat. I'm super excited for this. My only timer right now is a QJ, which works the way it should, except the data port doesn't work. When I try to plug a cable into the data port, it just, it just like, literally shoots out of the port. This timer is much better. It's built much better, much higher quality, and much more accurate. And I can use it with a computer. Alright, so here is the bag. Uh, I could fit the timer and maybe eight pulses in here. I'm not really sure. Okay, so this is the timer. Oh boy, I'm excited for this. And this is the mat. Okay, so let's get into the timer first. Okay, here it is. Just have pull the tab out. Nice. Oh, it's super sensitive. Wow. All right, let's open up the mat. Okay, so I did, as you can see, I did decide to get the green one. It also comes in a gray version, which looks like this. And the reason I got the green version was because it matches my YouTube logo very well, at least the color scheme. Uh, and it's supposed to fit into the timer. All right, there. No. You know, it's, it's attached. Let's try it for a solve. Four point five six zero. So, yeah, this is really cool so far. I'm gonna try connecting it to my computer and see if I can get that. Okay, so it's been quite a while, like two and a half weeks or something, and I can't connect the stack mat timer to the computer. I've watched several YouTube tutorials on how to do that, and there are a few very specific things that the tutorials have said to do, and I've tried all those. I've tried a whole bunch of different things, and I can't get it. The only kind of response I can get from the computer at all is when I open CS Timer on Firefox and then I shut off the timer, the zeros on CS Timer change to dashes. So I know that there is a signal, it's just not getting a signal to actually import the times. Other than that, the timer is really nice. Nice that these are curved upward instead of just going straight out. Uh, very sensitive and very accurate. The mat, uh, kind of a weird design with this fake metal and fake screws and an abstract green cubes in the middle. And ideally it would be a little bit smaller, but I'm not upset at all. It's really, or the quality is really nice. And then the bag, I haven't used yet. I'll probably use it whenever I'm going somewhere and I need to bring multiple cubes, like on an overnight trip or to a competition. But it seems to be a pretty good bag. So overall, this set of three Speedstacks products is very good. My next video will be an unboxing of a real microphone. So until then, goodbye. <laughs>